Hey everyone, I'm Victor Dwyer, and today I'm going to show you why you keep getting the zero in your scorecard on Looker Studio. Let's dive right into it. So right now I'm in my test Facebook ads dashboard under Looker Studio. And as you can see here, all the conversions are zero. So what's happening here is that it's trying to aggregate a bunch of different event types, which won't aggregate very well. So for example, we might have website subscriptions, we might have event responses, and when you try to combine that, the Facebook ads manager will not even consider combining them so when you try to pull that data from Facebook itself it is going to also have that error as well but what we can do is that we can pull each source individually into its own column under looker studio so for example if we wanted to pull all the event responses under this campaign and all the website completions over here this would have to be under two separate columns under looker studio so let's go do that right now so if I go back to looker studio and I type in event responses I'm gonna be able to go over here and put it under a metric and then here will be all my event responses of everything that I wanted to show under that column and from here it will actually aggregate correctly and I'll be able to pull that data no problem and the next thing I'm gonna pull is the website registrations completed and I'm gonna also make that its own column okay and now here I have it I have the event responses and I have the website registrations completed so now I have them both broken out into separate columns that will actually aggregate the data correctly now and from here the summary will actually be able to aggregate itself from there so just remember if you're in Facebook Ads Manager and you are seeing that these are not being summarized under Facebook Ads Manager, they will most likely not be able to be also summarized within Looker Studio as well. And this goes across every single data source that you see most of the time. But if you're still getting zeros in your scorecard, there's one other thing you can try under the attribution settings. So we're going to go up to resource here and then we're going to go manage added data sources. And from here, I'm going to press edit. And from here, I'm going to go in the top left here and press edit connection. And from this point, I'm going to check mark a allow action attribution settings to be modified in the reports and then I'm going to go in the top right and press reconnect and then I'm going to press allow and then I'm going to press apply okay and once we go out of that I'm going to click back on my table I'm going to scroll down to the very bottom under parameters you're going to see this action attribution settings right here you can change between the account attribution settings and the default ad set attribution settings and if you rotate between these you're going to be able to get possibly some numbers to fill in those fields to make sure your attribution settings are right when it comes to your reporting and that's it now you're able to fix the problem of getting zeros in your scorecard on Looker Studio. Hope that helps. Let me know if you have any other questions.